This is such a ripoff. Hi, welcome back to another video. I'm so happy that you guys are here. I just want to say I hope you guys had an amazing Easter. We went to Knoxbury Farm and we had such a great time. And I do want to give a shout out to somebody very special. Like, look how cute this picture is. Literally, she's the only one who sent me a picture of her finding the Easter eggs with fidgets inside that we hid all over Knoxbury Farm. I'm going to hide all the eggs in Captain Yuki, guys. Right in the entrance, you're going to see these two little guys. Thank you so much for participating. I love you. We also ran into some dailies yesterday. How cute were they? They were so cute. There's three of them and it was literally so cute. They literally ran up to us and just like hugged us. Literally, it was so freaking like heartwarming, right? Yeah. It just made us so happy. I also noticed that there was like some kids like looking at us, but they were like too shy to come up to us and I wish they would. If you guys see us in public, make sure to come up to us. Like don't be scared. We're so happy to meet you. And if you're too shy, just give us a little wave and I'll come up to you. Anyways, we're at Five Below today and I'm gonna show you guys the best fidgets to buy from Five Below. And the worst ones. There are a lot of bad ones, like they're puppets. I don't like them very much. Let's go inside. Okay, stand still. Ooh, I need it. it. I know. Ooh. There's no way that I could do it. <gasps> what are these? Where are they? They're so cute. Which one would you get? Oh, I like their eyes. I like this one because he's hairy. Yeah, I like his hairy eyes. Oh my Look God. at that one, so cute. That's the one I was gonna pick. Oh my God, it's literally so cute. These are actually worth buying here at Five of Malo. Not only do you get six for only $5, they glow in the dark. Like that's pretty epic. I would say definitely buy these from Five Below for sure. Could these be considered to be little mini brands? They're so cute. Look at the little hot dog. So I personally consider slime to be a fidget, right? No. Kind of. It's kind of a fidget. I'm going to show you guys the slimes to buy and not to buy. I would say definitely don't buy this. This is definitely a ripoff. The putty is very dry. Like I have bought this before. By the time I opened it to make a video, I couldn't even use it because the putty is so dry. On top of that, the layers are so sticky. Like it's practically stuck together. There's like a little plastic keeping it apart and it just is the worst. So I would say don't buy this. I've never tried this, that but for... Fun. Yeah, but for $5, I feel like that's kind of pricey. I wouldn't buy this either. This is also $5, and I feel like that's overpriced. I wouldn't buy that. This, I would definitely buy. Like, I definitely think this is a good deal, and this is definitely worth it. Um, and they have it in all of these colors. They have it in gray, gold. They also have it in purple and teal. I believe this is $3, and this is cool. Like, I'm okay with that. Yeah, it's $3.25, so I think that's cool. These superhero slimes are $5. You can get slime just like this from the Dollar Tree, so I would say don't buy that. This is a ripoff. Do not buy this, you guys. Like, literally, it, this is the worst thing that Five Below Snails. <laughs> like, I thought it was really cool when I got it. Like five Below Snails? Five Below Cell. So you guys never want to buy this. Like, this is such a ripoff. Like, I do not recommend that. I don't know what this is. It's not a squishy. It's called the Lazy Egg. Dude, this isn't sushi. Yes, it is. It's sushi. Oh. And this is an egg. Another oh, egg. Oh, okay. This but for five dollars, dude, is that worth they're it? They're really cute. I mean, just because they're cute doesn't mean that they're worth buying. I wouldn't buy that. Look at all those mini brands. Those are five dollars, you guys. Do not buy this. This is a ripoff. Like, do not buy that. You can literally get a mini brand with five surprises, and not just one for that price. So never buy that. These are really cute. These are actually fun to fidget with. I really like them, but they're $5. So if you're willing to spend that, then I guess it's worth it. But like, I would not buy this for $5. I would buy it for $3.50. That's worth $3.50, not five. This one has oh, it's broken. Oh, they break very easy, guys. It's literally just glue holding it. Keep your eyes open for that. You wanna make sure that it's like in a mug. sealed. Oh, that's a name. Yeah. Trick birthday candles. I literally always buy these for my family. That's super cute. It looks like you. It does look like me in the morning. Um, so the thing about poppets here at Five Below, like this is $5 and look at the size of it. 
I personally am not a fan of the poppets here at Five Below. I feel like they're very thin and not very crunchy. So I would say don't buy the poppets here at Five Below. Sorry, like I, I just don't like them. Um, this is definitely worth it. This is only $3.25. It's a hot dog and it's really good. yeah, this is definitely worth it. It's so stretchy and it's protected so like nobody's touched it. Like I would say definitely buy this from Five Below. These are $5 and they're worth literally every penny here at Five Below. They Why, have them. They they're just they're so, so cute and they're so comfortable, right? Tell me that's yeah. not like something that you just enjoy. Yeah, doing. it's better than holding on to this because it's so soft. Oh, they're so cute, dude. I love them. Oh my god, this one's fun. This one's tight, like, no one squeezed that one yet. This is definitely worth it. You guys buy this, those are not worth it. I don't understand I don't what these are it. for. These ducks are definitely not worth it, but this lobby ball is definitely worth it. You guys, how much is it? It's three dollars and twenty-five cents. I would say this is definitely worth it. It's cheaper than they are at Target, and they work really good. They don't pop very easy. Like I recommend you to buy these from Five Below. This is definitely worth five dollars. You can actually stretch it. Watch. This definitely don't buy this from Five Below. That's why there's so many of them left. They've had them for a while. They literally are it's the worst. So hard to yeah, you can't even squeeze them out. Like pull it. And, and then when it finally comes it. out, they have these little sandbags. I like them, but I don't know if they're worth $5. Like, what do you think? Like, if you have birthday money, you come in here with $10 to buy something, no. is that worth it? No. It's not, huh? Like, I'd rather buy this in a heartbeat. Like, this is worth $5, right? Yeah, and it's more squishy. Yeah, too. than this. This is cute if it was three twenty-five, dollars But that, like, that is so fun. Like, I love that so much. And then they have these little sensory fidget toys. I've never opened one, so I really can't say. <laughs> And then these, I've never got these. I feel like these remind me of the little ice packs for the babies or like the little teething rings. They're actually kind of fun. They're 3 three twenty five. dollars I would buy these. Much. You think it's too much? I think it's like $2, it's so tiny. Like it's literally so fun to play with. Like I really like these. Did you guys know that the best place to store your fidgets is inside of the refrigerator? So they're cold, Look, this like one it's so relaxing. That's so weird. Maybe somebody squeezed them all because it looked like it did once upon a time. Oh, it they dissolved? I don't know. I'm, I'm so confused about that. And then they have this sushi for $5, little squishies. I would say definitely come to Five Below and buy these. I definitely think that these are worth no, every penny. Sushi. I'm walking out of the store. We're all done. We're wrapping up here and I see this. This is a giant bubble wand. I mean, how cool is that for $3.25? I would say definitely buy this from Five Below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, you guys want to be the shout out they comment first 30 minutes of the video and in order to comment on the first 30 minutes of the video you guys have to subscribe and turn on post notifications bye wait this is shout out of the day i'm sorry i'm teaching her guys i thought you already did no i didn't shout out of the day take yourself away with shout out of the day